This is going to be a two lap challenge like you have never seen. It's time to bring the action at the Indianapolis 500. Here we go. Who's going to do it? Great restart, Erickson. Phenomenal jump from the number eight. Look at him swerving, trying to break the track. Rosen now caught to the award. Rosenquist and I want on the inside. Tony Kanan is not going to let that happen. Kanan at the high side on the dirty track. Kanan hangs on. And side by side action is what Marcus Erickson wants to see, but Pato Award is now in lockstep. He's going to have a great draft down the back straight, but Marcus trying to break it. They know that there is only one lap to go. When they come to the Yard of Bricks, they'll see the white flag. It's a Swedish snake on the back stretch trying to break the draft. What does Erickson do on the front stretch? Here comes Award with a run. Neither of these two in the front have won the Indy 500. There is two and a half miles to go. And Award is on the attack. Here comes Pato. Erickson won't let it happen. Phenomenal driving from both men. I don't know if Award's going to be able to gather it back up. That might have been his big chance. They exit two and go to the back stretch. Erickson leads by five car lengths. Erickson has shaken off the challenge of the Aaron McLaren SP in really Crash. bold driving. Crash in turn two. Yellows out. It'll finish under caution. It's Sage Karam. Marcus Erickson with the spirit of Ronnie Peterson on board with his helmet joins Kenny Brack as the only other Swede. But he just won the Indy 500. Marcus Erickson wins the Indianapolis 500 in the most dramatic way.